in a standing room only meeting of the Colchester Select Board, praise. Colchester Rescue supports this. We've always worked well with all three departments over the years. Questions. I'm wondering if we have talked to um, Williston and South Burlington about their transitions from volunteer to paid. And the naming of a new fire chief, a familiar face to many. The best choice that we unanimously came up with was Steve Bourgeois. Steve Bourgeois was previously chief of the Mallets Bay Fire Department. Now he's being given the task of leading a new department, combining the resources of three into one. Feels very, well, very good, very good. I really look forward to the future. Um, I look forward to working with all three departments. With the addition of three full-time paid firefighters, the new chief reassured the crowd here that the daytime response times, an area of concern for years, will improve. Quicker than they do right now. They'll be with the truck, you know, with with the three members and they can respond in a couple of minutes. The loudest opposition to the plan came from a Facebook post this week, put out by the chief of the Colchester Center Volunteer Fire, one of the departments merging. I will be speaking with him in the next week or so, sitting down with each individual chief and uh, trying to, to move everything forward in a positive way. Now, we had initially expected to see folks at tonight's meeting expressing concerns over the uh, unification over the weekend. Colchester Center Volunteer Fire posted they will hold their own meeting tomorrow night to air their grievances. If all goes according to plan, however, the three departments should be joined under one unified uh, management structure on July 1st. We're live in Colchester, Nathaniel Reed, NBC5 News.